2010 um, Ruby 65 uh, in Hong Kong for sale. Uh, the boats in a great condition, impressive. So uh, first things first, always look at the teak. Uh, if the teak is good, the boat is good. Uh, that's 90% of experience, 90% uh, of the time. Uh, so there it goes. Uh, this has an up and down swim platform at uh, the back. Very nice teak table on the cockpit. maker inside it's the ice maker where you need it the interior of the boat is impressive and uh, I, I am a fan of ruby yachts um, uh, I've, I've worked with the factory closely very closely I've designed boats with them um, I know how they build them and um, and and one thing about boats it's it's a, a new boat will always look good okay no matter which factory builds it uh, but if you really want to see the quality of the boat then look at it after 10 years like this one this is a 10 year old boat and you cannot imagine this is a 10 year old boat I've seen five year old boats which are in terrible condition you know just by natural wear and tear okay so if they were similarly used they would wear wear down a lot more and this is not the wood is good uh the 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 fabric uh, you know uh layout layup of the fabric is good there is there is no water leakage and this is all original you can tell okay? um, because it's impossible to find the same wood to replace in hong kong right so this is all original and and it's it's uh i mean there are two things good maintenance and good build and uh, i think this boat is both you know maintained well and is built well so up and down platform uh, tv um it's got a dvd players and stuff like that storage you know uh, these um, those things uh, very nice dinette area year is it's actually a beautiful day today to look at boat it is very hot though uh, so um, here is the galley uh, very well designed um, uh, around 2010 uh, a 60 footer 65 footer boat this is kind of a very common layout uh, of all the boats that were uh, that were selling well during this time okay? so this is the you know, again this is the fridge Sorry, this is a fridge here. Free, this is the freezer. Yeah. There's a little lock in the fridge that I need to. Ah, there it is. Okay, here you go. Yep. You 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 need these uh, small little locks on boats. You know, it's a wise thing to do because when your boat is bumping on the sea all these fridge and doors will be opened and shattered you know so um, so uh, small wisdoms yeah. so here you go you look at the uh, ceiling uh, vinyl vinyl of the ceiling is impressive why because it's not coming off after 10 years in Hong Kong and in these 10 years there have been at least 10 terrible typhoons okay uh, so so and 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 the weather is hot humid everything uh, this boat has zero smell of any humidity uh, and and the vinyl is intact it's original not even a small tiny bit of leakage or any kind of miscoloring uh, the carpet is 
normal okay so um, all good you know uh, the floor very nice sturdy hard um, I like the idea of having this material which is kind of a fabric material not canvas not vinyl uh, it, it feels like a woolen fabric uh, but uh, uh, it's been 11 years and it's it's it looks like it's almost new so can't go wrong with this you know now here is uh, the okay what should i do i think uh, uh, let's go to the port cabin guest cabin first uh bunk beds in the guest cabin natural light okay yeah let's put on the other lights as well simple simple good storage a wardrobe a tv speaker good to retire at night you know there is an air con uh, outlet you got fresh air <laughs> okay uh let's go to the uh forward cabin it's huge it is big uh, again we're talking about a boat that is 65 footer and and uh a room this size is actually very impressive um i mean looks just beautiful the colors the wood the condition here is a toilet here um, here you go. Very nice. Big mirror. Okay. Uh, shower on top with a handheld shower. Electric toilet. Nice uh, railing to put on your towels and stuff. I mean, the boat's, boat has been used. It's not like it hasn't been used. Uh, but it doesn't look like it has been used. Because... I'm sure they maintain it well. And this is the master cabin. Here we go. Let's see, uh, full beam layout. So it's a full beam mid cabin, right in the middle of the boat. And behind the master cabin is the engine room. Uh, so there we go. You know. Uh, Nice uh, glass window on the toilet. Um, another view of the master cabin. Okay, I'm going to look at the ceiling. The ceiling, wood veneer, the vinyls. Tells a lot about the boat. A lot about the way it's built and the way it's maintained. Um, they have these little uh, uh, leather uh, things. Quite luxurious to touch on the doors and in, in the middle of the wooden panel. It's cool. And it's well done by Ruby. <laughs> yep, sorry. There you go. Uh, so this, uh, this has a rain shower. This, this, this uh, a toilet is a lot taller. Okay, so I'm. as my hand can reach so uh, well, the, the, the layout of the boat allows the toilet to be this tall so that's a plus point um, it's got a nice uh, below the bed light night light I go up on the flybridge huge uh, basically hard top okay a uh, hard top makes a lot of sense here because it is just one helm here uh, and you can use this helm uh, obviously when it's raining the weather is bad so it's got all this uh, all weather covers uh, so the helm can always be used the control station uh, here is a nice uh, uh, seating area sink you know let's see what's under here ah fridge fridge and fridge and storage these are the areas where you need a fridge and this is a 
one of my favorite little things you know here you put it up you put it up and there you go you got a nice uh, thing to barbecue or hot pot or whatever you like you know cook, cook up a little something here such a good thing for the whole family and friends yeah. the, the functionality the way you the things you put uh, you know uh, on the boat that creates the dynamics on how you're gonna use it and what you're gonna how much you're gonna enjoy it so small things matter yes a lot uh, yeah, this uh, whole radar, GPS, uh, antennas, blah blah blah, all these things. Uh, yep. Very nice. There is a forward area, huge again, and when I walked around it. toilet crew cabin two beds uh, this is a 20 kilowatts caller generator washing machine water heater engine room the sea keeper amazing little thing yeah. uh, this is a stabilizer very expensive thing very very expensive thing. Uh, here is the engine room Yanmar engines I uh, forgot the horsepower, not, can't remember now. Should be in the specs. Uh, good reputation. Yeah, good reputation. Uh, I guess we're done. <laughs>